viva! Viva! Cau, cau, viva! 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 Numsa, numsa, viva! Viva! Uh, comrade, my task is very short. Um, I've been given a task to summarize the memorandum and I will hand over to the management of Imvuna. Like many comrades have already said that the reason we are here is the non-compliance of Imvuna. Imvuna is one of the biggest black-owned company. It pains us if we had to come and picket to people who majority shareholders are black. It pains us because black should understand the pain that we are suffering on a daily basis. The demands that we are submitting here are not thumbs up. These are issues that affect the workers. We, as the security industry, we have um, embarked on a process of improving the benefit of the security worker. Just last year, we have concluded a wage agreement in which the across the board increase. It's plus or minus 13 percent. Now, we can't get those big achievements. And you come to the employers who majority uh, shareholders are black and they don't comply. Now, the three, the four unions that are here, which is Aum, Satau, Aum, and the NUMSA have organizational right in this company. And hence the collaboration that the three uni the four unions are here to demand that there is a, compl a compliance. Part of the of the memorandum says that um Imvula is one of the companies that is non-compliant on the medical cover. Now, two years back, the industry introduced a medical cover. And that medical cover, you will know that the employee in the first year were paying 150 and the company was paying 100 rand. The second year, the company is paying 100 and, 150 and the employee pay 100 rand. Now, this game did not come um, just on the silver uh, spoon. We had to demand, fight, and improve the conditions of the workers. After the conclusion of the agreement and the, the promulgation of the, of the main agreement, which is extended to all companies, Imvula decided to appoint their own company, which is not in line with the National Bargaining Council for the private security sector. 